Hey, it's Nori, the reporter with the Frederick Douglass Memorial Bridge Project team. I have Mr. John Muller, and he's going to give us a bit of education about how Mr. Frederick Douglass was in his neighborhood of Anacostia and what that looked like in the 1870s. Check this out. Frederick Douglass was known to keep horses. He had a stable on his property, but he was uh, actually known as someone who... Uh, decide not to take an Uber or Lyft of his day. He was known to walk throughout the community. He would walk from his house at Cedar Hill across the Navy Yard Bridge, the Eastern Branch Bridge, down Pennsylvania Avenue, up 4th Street to his offices in the old City Hall building where he worked as Marshal of the District and uh, as Recorder of Deeds of the City. And so this horse tie is very interesting because it's a a kind of a physical remnant of a previous era before we had Model A's and Model T's or Tesla's and so uh, this is just kind of a uh, you know physical uh, symbol of a pre combustible engine era when our uh, our fuel was hay that we would feed to our horses so I think it's very nice that this is still here and uh, the Frederick Douglass house is just right around the corner so it kind of helps to get people into the uh, you know, maybe historic mindset of what it was like when Frederick Douglass was an active member of the community. Thank you so much, Mr. Muller. To learn more about the Frederick Douglass Memorial Bridge Project, visit our website, www.newfrederickdouglassbridge.com.